three-stage PCP pump consists of three tubes. There are also three pistons in it. You can see the separate parts of the pump. Pump and takes the air from the hole and handle and then releases pressurized air. The external tube is the first stage tube. First stage piston is installed in it. This piston moves around the second stage tube. Third stage piston moves in the third tube. When air enters, it pushes the rubber ball down to open airway. When handle is pulled, air enters into the first tube through the hole in the handle. Air goes into the third tube through the second stage piston. Third piston rod also moves through it. There are two O-rings around the piston rod. These O-rings are tightened with the help of a screw. There are two cuts below the O-rings of this piston. The holes in the piston lead the air into the third tube from the first tube. The third stage piston rod is attached to the handle. It also moves with the handle. Third stage piston consists of a screw, spring, washer, O-ring, and seal. Seal can close or open the air passage. Seal on the piston uncovers the air passage. It allows the air to go into the third tube. While pulling the handle, air fills the first tube and the third tube at the same time. When the handle is pushed, rubber ball closes the inlet hole. In the third tube, piston seal closes the air passage. At this point, the piston O-ring separates the air of the third tube from the first tube. Air in the first tube is compressed, while third tube air comes out through the outlet valve. First tube pressure keeps increasing. The both pressures remain separated until the pressure of the first tube pushes the seal. It opens the air passage again and all air is pushed out of the pump. The outlet valve also called high pressure valve because when the pump is connected to the gun it holds high pressure in the base cavity. In the three-stage PCP pump air does not go into the second-stage tube. This tube is empty or filled with some coolant agent like water.